it needs to be part of your life. You need to make this uh, your main priority. If you want to learn Ar the Arabic language and you want to be successful at it and not spend years and years and years trying and trying and trying like it happens to many students, they go year after year after year after, after five years, six, ten years, they have been learning the Arabic language and they don't get, um, they don't get the fluency yet. They're not comfortable with it yet. They not, and it's unnecessary. All of these long years is they are unnecessary. It shouldn't take that long, but it requires first of all to make it a priority. Later on, we will talk about keeping the momentum, which is very important as well. And I need you guys to pay attention on that video as well. But first of all, let's talk about how you make it part of your life. First of all, let me read to you a qawl by Ibn Qudama al-Maqdisi, one of the ulama uh, of Islam. He said, وَيَنْبَغِ لَهُ لِطَالِبِ الْعِلْمِ And it's important uh, for the talib al-ilm قَطْعُ الْعَلَائِقَ الشَّاغِلَةِ is important for him to cut all ties, all relations, all relationships that are shaghila, that occupies him, whether are physically, whether are mentally. He should cut all of these ties, all of these relationships. He should cut them, cut them out for the student of knowledge if he wants to be successful. فَإِنَّ الْفِكْرَ مَتَى تَوَزَّعَتْ قَصُرَتْ عَنْ إِدْرَاكَ الْحَقَائِقِ because when the fikra, when thinking about it, when being busy, when your mind is busy thinking about things, about other people, about other uh, subjects and, and things that are not directly your main priorities, uh, when they become a lot, your thoughts, is, is less probably that you are going to understand and catch the realities as in because this speech is, is quite eloquent as in when your mind is busy thinking about other things when your mind is busy with different thoughts it's hard for you to understand things when they are explained to you on the first glance on the first uh time that they are explained to you why because while you are watching something while you are listening to a lesson why you are listening to the teacher your mind is thinking about this thinking about that after the lesson I need to do this after the lesson I need to do that this person wants me to do this for him this person was and he just it and idrak al as in it became less less probably for you to understand the thing at the first thing at the first time is is uh, is explained to you and here's what we want to get at the end of this قول, Ibn Qudam al-Maqdisi, he says, وَقَدْ كَانَ السَّلَفُ يُؤْثِرُونَ الْعِلْمَ عَلَى كُلِّ شَيْءٍ وَقَدْ كَانَ السَّلَفُ يُؤْثِرُونَ الْعِلْمِ عَلَى كُلِّ شَيْءٍ And the Salaf, the predecessors, the scholars of Al-Islam, those who left with us all of this, all of this text and all of this knowledge, كَانُوا يُؤْثِرُونَ they, they, they made a priority and they would prefer Al-Ilm before everything and this is where we want to come and the objective of this, of this video is to make you understand this seeking knowledge in the arabic language learning the arabic language in this case it should be the asl of your life right now it should be the main priority the main thing to the point of if you are in the street and you meet someone that you didn't see for a long time and he asks you Ya Fulan, what are you, what are you up to these, these days? The first thing that comes to your mind is, I'm learning the Arabic language. Yes, we all have responsibilities. We all work. We all uh, have families. We all have responsibilities that are legit responsibilities. They cannot uh, go away from your life. But your main priority, as soon as you free that time up and as soon as you uh, you know stop doing those priorities and taking care of them the first thing that you do and the first thing that you think of is your main priority 
which should be the Arabic language, is if you want to be successful at it and do it in the shortest amount of time and period uh, possible. طيب, so the, the Salaf, they used to make al-ilm and seeking knowledge the asl of their life. Is the asl, is the root, is the main thing of their life. And the rest of it is just furu, furu'at, meaning uh, branches. Your work is a branch. It's not the main thing. It's not what I live for. Uh, you know, your secular studies is not the main thing that I live for. Uh, your, your, your relationships with friends is not the main thing that I live for. The main thing that I live for is to understand the Arabic language so later on I can go ahead and memorize the Quran and understand it and understand what Allah and His Prophet are telling me for me to secure my spot in the paradise. If you don't become obsessed like this, in this way, it will be very, very, very hard to go ahead and apply and be efficient in the learning of the Arabic language.